More than half of Americans die in a hospital, a quarter in an intensive care unit. All too often, families find themselves having to make end-of-life decisions for a loved one who can no longer speak for themselves, and they have never discussed what kind of care their loved one would want. When you have either a near-death experience or something has suddenly changed in how you're going to live your life, you have a new paralysis, you have a new diagnosis, it's an opportunity to have a conversation that ideally should be continued. Along with having a conversation, Dr. Carla Carr encourages patients to fill out Tennessee's Advanced Care Plan, which is a legal document acknowledging a person's end-of-life decisions so they can be shared and followed. Tennessee has an advanced care plan, which is a living will that goes through qualities of life, which is a really nice document because it goes through how would you feel if you were comatose, how would you feel if you were permanently confused, dependent where you couldn't walk or talk or bathe, or had a condition that had no more treatments. Tennessee's advanced care plan also provides a way to designate a health care agent. The health care agent is the person you would want to speak for you in the case that you can no longer make decisions for yourself. These are contingency plans. If we have to make one of these very important decisions, that person then would be my spokesperson in the instance when I couldn't speak for myself. To access Tennessee's Advanced Care Plan form, log on to our website at wmpt.org slash aging matters.